Yeah, we're pretty satisfied. Um, we started our pre-season a lot later than uh, some of the other teams, uh, given <coughs> obviously they have uh, cup competitions to, to contend with. Um, obviously, our, uh, most of, a lot of our personnel also have day jobs, which means that they can't always take their breaks, uh, some of them being teachers at the same time as others. But yeah, look, we've, we've got through a week and a half of, of good training. Uh, some good the players have showed you know good spirit, good intensity in training, and uh, yeah, so far so good. I mean, this was the first time today that we uh, we really got the ball out and played a bit of a, a, a match, uh, albeit a um, a training match. But uh, yeah, very impressed. You know, some players moving in another direction. You know, some of them. Uh, it was their choice to move in another direction and we wish them all the best. You know, uh, you know, we've made some decisions as to the way that we see, we, we're trying to build the squad uh, this year. Um, I think the new players that have come in, like I say, have shown, you know, they've, they've all come from professional clubs. So, you know, the mentality is very strong. Um, you know the desire. They, they, you know, they're coming to the club to to continue with their development as well. You know, nearly all of them. They, you know, they're all under 28 years of age. You know, 19. You know, 20, 24, 23. You know, 27. I still feel there's you know lots of potential with a lot of them. You know, a lot of the players have not had as much football last season um, that we that we bought in as they should have, in my opinion. Um, you know, the way that we see things, we enjoy, you know, um, bringing the young players through and giving them an opportunity. And I think that shows in, you know, uh, young Tim, you know, uh, his, you know the, the opportunities that he's got last year. And I think that's helped us attract some of the young players to come to the club, knowing that, you know, if you're good enough, you're old enough. Hock Ming, you know, for me is a player that I tried to sign last season. So, you know, for me, it's, it's a delight that we've managed to get him this season. Uh, I think he'll bring, you know, a lot of experience uh, to, to, the, to the team and, you know, a, a very level headed player, you know, good character, gels very well with the team. So, you know, he, he's, he feels part of the furniture already. You know, Maddox has, has come in and, 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 you know, wants to show that he can play in this league, given the opportunity. And we, we hope that he'll take the opportunity that we'll give him. Khan's uh, has only just arrived back, was stuck abroad. Um, so he's only come, but he's been back a week, but he's, he's obviously had some issues. Some, um, he's been a, a bit poorly coming back. Um, so, like I say, he's only, only been with us for, for the past week. Ryan today uh, and you know throughout you know the the weeks that uh, uh, that he's been with us has done really well you know and and and, uh, and as far as uh, Tiger's concerned you know again he's a player that I can that I know that can you know can play football um, he has the quality he can find the pass you know we just need to get him fit you know he's a player that didn't play much last year um, I'm not sure why, um, but didn't get much game time. But you know, we feel that he can bring something to the club, you know, and make us bigger, better, and stronger, you know, to compete uh, in this coming season.